In our high school geometry courses, sometimes we have to do a reflection. Here are three examples of reflections. To start doing this reflection, I start by zeroing the ruler on the closest vertex to the reflection line. And then I swivel the ruler until the edge of the ruler is perpendicular to the reflection line. I can use the little lines on the ruler to help judge this. And then I see how far it is between that vertex and the reflection line. In this case, I think it is about one centimeter. I double that. One times two is two. So starting from zero, I count to two centimeters and I put a dot. This is the reflection of vertex P and I'll call it P prime. Going to the next closest vertex, I do the same thing. I zero the ruler on the vertex. I make sure the edge of the ruler is perpendicular to the reflection line. I measure 31 and a half millimeters, so I double that and I get 63. Starting from zero, I count 63 millimeters and I put a dot. That was vertex R, so its reflection is R prime. Now I'm on the last vertex. I zero the ruler. I make sure the edge of the ruler is perpendicular to the reflection line. I count 45 millimeters. I double that to 90, so I put a dot at 90 millimeters. It was Q, so this is Q prime. Now all I have to do is connect the dots. Once I've done that, I have a nearly perfect reflection of my original figure. This technique will work even in this second example where the figure crosses the reflection line. I go to the nearest vertex to the line, which is X. I zero the ruler on X. I make sure the ruler is perpendicular and I see it's about 10 and a half millimeters. So I double that to 21 and right at 21 on my ruler, I draw my X prime. Now I'm going to move over to W. Zero it. Perpendicular, 18 millimeters times two is 36. Put a dot at 36. That's my W prime. Now V, zero it. Make sure the ruler is perpendicular. I see 29 millimeters. I double that to 58 and I put a dot and that's my V prime. Connecting the dots. Results in a figure that is a reflection across the reflection line of figure VWX. In this bottom one, I'm doing the same technique. I zero my ruler at M, vertex M. I think that is 47 millimeters. I double it to 94. Put a dot. That's my M prime. I'm going to end now. Zero it. Perpendicular 68 millimeters times 2 is 136 millimeters. Put a dot. That's N prime. And L. Zero it. Perpendicular 70 millimeters times 2 is 140. I put a dot L prime and I connect the dots. Figure L prime, M prime, N prime looks like a perfect reflection across the reflection line of figure L, M, N. Do a few more for practice and you should be able to handle any question that asks you to draw a reflection.